Alright, when I was a kid, riding bikes was a big deal. Everybody in the neighborhood had a bike. Now me personally, I had a mountain bike. But not just any mountain bike, it was a big ass mountain bike. Shit looked like it was made for a 6 foot 5 lumberjack. I'm like the size of the kickstand. I have to use a trampoline just to get on the damn thing. Now, most of my friends had BMX bikes. They all thought they were pretty sweet because their bikes had pegs on them. David, your ass can't even bunny hop. What do you think, you're Matt Hoffman? Is your ass gonna grind down some handrails or something? Then we had my friend Michael, who had uh, the shittiest bike I've ever seen in my life. He's over there rolling around on a bike from the 1920s. <laughs> Who wants to get their ass beat in a race? Michael, nobody's gonna race you with your stupid ass Charlie Chaplin bike. Now, the four of us would ride around our neighborhood pretty much all summer long. To us, we were like a shitty little biker gang. Hey, we're like a bunch of bikers. How about you guys call me Tomahawk? Michael, I'd rather shit broken glass than call you Tomahawk, you know that? Well, shouldn't we have like a name or something for our bike gang? Yeah, let's be called something and tough, like, uh, like the scorpions. How about the panda bears? Yeah, Michael, let's be the panda bears. We'll get some leather jackets made and everything. Sounds real intimidating, doesn't it? Hey, what are you guys, the, uh, Hell's Angels? Yeah, that sounds pretty gay. We're the, uh, we're the panda bears. We'd be riding around the neighborhood. We got our fake tattoos and our candy cigarettes. David's over there wearing some broken sunglasses he found in the street. We would see who could make the longest skid mark in Michael's driveway. There'd be dozens of black marks all over the place. Michael's stepdad would come out. What the hell are you guys doing to the driveway. God damn it, Michael, you're getting 10 across the ass. We'd have all the chicks in the neighborhood checking out our sweet bikes. Yeah, there's 21 gears on this bad boy, and I have no idea how they work. Yeah, I'm practically in the X Games. One time I grinded on the Great Wall of China. Last summer, my stepdad found this bike in a river. We'd set up a little ramp in the street so we could soar a whole three feet into the sky. Michael would try to go off the ramp with his shitty little bike. Goddamn thing would explode on impact. Like a whole summer, Michael didn't have a bike, so he had to ride on David's pegs. Well, riding on pegs is like sitting on the bitch seat in the biker world. Nobody wants to do that. All right, we're going to the park. Get on the pegs, Michael. You're riding bitch. I don't want to ride bitch. Get on the goddamn pegs, Michael. You're riding bitch and you will like it. After a while, he started using his sister's pink Barbie bike. I think he had like one training wheel on it and shit. We didn't want to be seen in public with him, so we'd like ride like an extra 50 feet ahead of him. Just pretend we didn't know who the hell he was. Hey, guys, wait for me. Oh, why is that retarded kid on that Barbie bike following us? I have no idea. Now, on one particular day, we were out on the street, and we were racing each other. And one of our friends, Tommy, shows up on his bike, and he's with this kid, Jonathan. Now, we didn't like Jonathan that much because, uh, well, because he's an asshole. There's no other way to put it. He was just kind of a dick. And Tommy just hung out with him because, uh, he had a Sony PlayStation, which made sense to us. What are you guys doing? Are you guys, like, a bike gang or something? Yeah, we're the panda bears! Wow, that sounds pretty gay. We're the scorpions. God damn it, Michael, I told you scorpions was a better name. So, you guys, like... Like want a race or something? All right, we'll do a one versus one race down to the end of the street and back. Who's gonna go first on your team? Wait a minute, Michael. What the hell are you doing on their side? My name's not Michael. It's Tomahawk. God damn it, Michael. Get over here on our side. No, I'm changing teams. Jonathan said I could play his PlayStation. Oh, you're such a hooker, Michael. God damn it. All right, somebody help me on my bike. Michael, I am kicking your ass. Get on your stupid Barbie Dream House bike. Let's race. Thank you for joining us at 13 o'clock news. This just in, there's a drag race happening on Burton Avenue. We have Dan Peterson at the scene. Dan, what do you have for us? Well, Tom, it looks like it's the pandas versus the scorpions. It's like some kind of shitty West Side Story out here. That sounds astounding, Dan. Can you tell me who the competitors are? Well, Tom, it looks like a toddler on a giant bicycle versus a transvestite on a Barbie bike. So we start racing, and we are flying down the street. I'm changing gears all willy-nilly. Michael's pedaling that little Barbie bike like he just robbed a liquor store. But the thing is, is that this little girl bike was never meant to go over nine miles an hour. Michael's flying on the road. Well, imagine his surprise when the chain pops and he goes soaring through the air and cracks his face on the pavement. So I see this happen, and I do what anybody would do. I keep on fucking going. We're in the middle of a goddamn race. Michael's ass could have been shot by a rifle, and I wouldn't even have stopped for a second. He's on the ground. There's blood all over the place. He's crying. <laughs> I get back to everybody else and I'm like, yeah, you guys can suck it. This is panda property. Bamboo boys for life. Uh, where's Michael at? Well, that is a good question, isn't it, Jonathan? Where is little Tomahawk after all? I'll tell you where he's at. He's limping his jacked up Barbie bike back home. That's where he's at. He's still got tears in his eyes. His face is all bloody and shit. God damn it, Michael. What did you do to your sister's bike? Now you're getting 20 across the ass. BrewStew.com